So for Florida, it's been a little cold out today and kind of uncomfortable, so I don't want to go ahead and do any welding outside. And I'm sure it's colder where you're at. It's always colder where somebody else is, so I don't need to hear it. So we decided to do a little bit of work on the doodle bug today. And I started up a rudimentary drawing for a gas tank because that's something that the bike is lacking with that new motor. So I went and I built it into a model form. And this model that you see right here is made out of cardboard, but I'm going to transfer that into metal and have it all welded together. And we're going to do that real soon. Get your shit off the counter. I'm trying to cook dinner. Oh, Jesus Christ. Pokey. Hey, get the fuck out of here. So anyways, we're back in the garage. And I built this little model that you guys know, which is made from cardboard. And it fits right up there for the moment. And that's about what our line is going to look like for the Doodlebug gas tank. I preferred something a little bit smaller, but this is what I ended up uh, building in the model form, and I could reduce the size of the components slightly to produce something a little bit different, but I think it looks pretty cool where she sits. It does clear the handlebars, and that was kind of important. It clears it by oh, about an inch and a half or something on that side, so we should be good to go for that department. And uh, I'm kind of happy with it. So probably next week we're going to transfer that into steel form and get the thing welded together. But uh, just a small update for this weekend. We got us a uh, gas tank model to go on the old doodle bastard. And on a related note, the CR500 Street Racer project is here. And it's finally got a path that I can just about get it out the door. So we're glad to be working on that uh, sometime in the near future. As soon as we can finish getting it out of this room.